So now I'm just gonna add it, a little safety pin, onto where I'm doing it, and I'm gonna focus this down below, more down. And then I'm going to scoot this towards us. So now you guys can see this. Okay. So far we got it and we have the middle part. This looks really gapped up here. But it's not supposed to be like that. So if you guys been doing yours tight, your guys should look right. And I am trying to make the video where you can see like the whole thing my last couple of videos were really up close and I kept restarting them because my hand was in the way so what you're gonna do we need this part so I'm just gonna go left knot left knot pass over and then I'm gonna do another left, another string left knot If not, pass over and then another one. This is the middle string. So I'm going to stop at this part. Left knot. Left knot. And we can going to put that in the middle. And now this on the side. But this one I just did needs to stay kind of right there. And then I'm going to do this way. So you're going to do a right knot. If you don't know how to do it, go check out my other videos called how to make a right knot or how to make a left knot although they're really easy so if you forgot it's kind of hard to forget and I'm also just gonna quickly play some music oops I skipped it I'm s this is not how it's supposed to go all of it but it should look like a V and it's just like the diagonal, but you just stop in the middle. Once you stop in the middle, you go like this. And then you have these two. And then you make a right knot with this string. And make sure you do them all like, tight or something. And once you got it tight, there you go. Okay, now I'm going to show you guys my book. And you can sort of read it you will need these are the instructions that I read you will need to cut four lengths 30 you need to cut four 36 lengths of A and A is pink if you want to make it look like this three colors so I have one single and this little square up here is just like the easy box the circle's easy, the square's um, about in the middle between easy. No, it goes easy, middle, and then it goes too hard. And then the seconds you need to tie together, tape down. And then right here it says A, A, B, C, B, C, A, A. Like the one pattern I showed you guys on my first shoving bracelet. And then it just says... On the left side, make a left knot with an A onto A, remember to tie twice. Repeat knot with A onto C, like I said, then A onto B. Now make a right knot. Make a right knot in. Now make a right knot side. Now on the right side, make a right knot with an A onto A, remember to tie twice again. And you just repeat it till you get to C. And then now make a right knot in the center with A onto A. And the V will form. And then repeat. Always working with outside threads to the center until the bracelet is the right length. Tie a knot and trim it. And here it says an idea. And it says look for unusual buttons or beads for your bracelets. Um, I haven't shown a video how to add buttons or beads, but I might soon, but I might not. If you want one really bad, just...